back again with another video and I'm actually sitting in the airport right now but I thought I'd bring you guys a quick video uh, despite that, despite my situation um, if I told you the story of what's been happening uh, you'd say I wouldn't be able to make it up but um, let's just get into the video so right now I'm looking at Vidal okay and it seems that Vidal has actually been listed on Poloniex exchange okay if we go to the Twitter page we'll be able to see an announcement about that so just bear with me just a moment because I haven't actually prepared anything uh, like I said I'm sitting in the airport but I thought you know I'm so bored I might as well do you guys a video uh, about Baida and uh, let you guys know what's going on um, if you like me and you're awake then you probably be, probably know that already um, but yeah as you can see Baida has been listed on Poloniex exchange okay and uh, you can now actually put your deposits in and you can actually get a pool of a thousand uh, USDT so you can actually get some rewards on that oh, well guys so go and check that out um, if you look at the chart, it seems while I've been on an airplane coming back from Greece, I'm actually in Ireland at the moment. For those of you that don't know, I'm in Ireland. But I've had to leave my wife behind uh, because her visa is not allowed her into Ireland. And now I'm going to have to go home and try and get her back to the UK. So hopefully it will sort itself out. Booked her into another hotel for a week. And uh, yeah, I'll get on that first thing in the morning trying to get her home. But let's remain positive for the time being, as we can see that this would have been the buy down pump potentially, right over here, or should I say the Poloniex pump, 31%. Okay, did kind of put in a higher high over here, but swiftly went straight back to the downside. So it's not looking too great in terms of price action at the moment. Okay, that could be the bulk of our pump right there, and it is actually a Friday evening going into a Saturday morning so it definitely doesn't look good to see it roll all the way back to the downside like that I would have liked to have seen it continue up but um, you know nevertheless still some good news with uh, Poloniex alright guys it is quite a well known exchange um, probably the best exchange that's been listed on aside from Uniswap at the moment so at the moment we've got Uniswap we've also got uh, Poloniex we've also got Who.com and I can't remember if there's one more or not, but uh, we know that it's seven exchanges in total altogether. All right, guys, some people might be disappointed in the price action with buy down, but um, you know, this pump would have been a breath of fresh air for a few. Um, so if you did get in down there, that would have been a nice trade. All right, guys, but at the moment for the bag holders, it's not looking too great and not looking too promising at the moment. Uh, my original target was down at about 0.18 cents down here. We haven't reached it yet. It has been holding this level quite well, actually, considering the circumstances. But um, yeah, if it does fall, up, fall down below this level, I do expect it to come down to that 0.18 uh, cents level. All right, guys, so just keep your eye on that okay moving on i did make a video earlier about moon day finance and moon day finance has actually taken off i got in down here all right guys and now i've got off the plane i've seen that actually took profits just before this little uh just before this little pullback over here because i'm expecting that it could potentially come down a little bit further now what i was hoping is that it would just get a load of green candles to the upside on the one hour and we haven't seen that but it is potentially in like a price discovery zone at the moment so we could get some more upside but just considering the week that i have i thought you know what let me just take some profits lock those profits in realize realize those gains and um you know focus on the next trade at the moment because at the end of the day this is um uh, you know something that's, that's, that's taken off based on you know speculation and it's you know if you look at my previous video we talked about some of the rewards you can get with that but at the moment you know i'd rather not take any risks um, did lose quite a little bit of money um, on DeFi um, altogether and now I'm trying to focus on getting it all back <laughs> but um, yeah I mean this is crypto there's good days there's bad days there's good weeks there's bad weeks there's actually good months and extremely bad months you can also get a good year and a bad year so um, you know I've had a, a good year but I've had a bad week all right guys so um, yeah right about now um, it's good it's good to see a little bit of profit when i've been making such losses and uh, did try and keep my head down and on holiday and just focus on the holiday 
but um, didn't last very long at the end of the day. I mean, it's, it's quite easy to get bored on holiday. Um, I've found, you know, after the first couple of days, uh, when you get there the first couple of days, you know, everything, you, you're feeling a bit pumped, you got the new scenery and all that sort of stuff. But after a couple of days, I was extremely bored, guys. The laptop came out, I was looking at the charts and all that sort of stuff. But at the same time, my focus wasn't fully in the charts. So, um, you know, I feel like I've lost out on some opportunity also. You know, we talked about Core. Now, if we look at Core, Core actually had a big pump all right guys uh based on um i think it's got something to do with the fact that they've got the the, the new liquidity event with a uh, wrapped bitcoin all right so from the bottom we talked about this earlier but from the bottom we saw it come all the way up about 83 percent so it came up a bit further since my previous video as well okay it came up just under 7k all right 6800 approximately all right guys and now we're seeing that dip now will that fall back to the downside or will it continue up we do have that curved uh, u-shape for me okay but if it breaks that then you know more downside and uh, we can see uh, uh, i do see a lot of the time that they do come up and then they get a little bit of a rejection all right so it's failed to make a new high so it's still not in bullish territory all right guys for it to get into bullish territory we need to see it make a new high take this level out above here and then go back into price discovery all right so no doubt a few people will be looking at that sort of price action on core all right guys it did it definitely did get pushed down here but that's not um that doesn't look like too much of a bad correction to me that looks uh, perfectly healthy perfectly fine and the fact that it's coming back to the upside now is putting a higher height over here all right so it does look like it is in a little bit of an uptrend, uptrend. Okay, we're being interrupted by the announcement, so bear with me. Social distancing announcement. Oh, it's completely <laughs> almost empty in this airport. There's a few people are sitting around, but um, yeah, let's just continue with the video. So basically, you can see that um, you know if it does put in a, 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 a you know a higher low over here, and then takes this level back out, then we can say we're almost definitely in an uptrend. All right, guys, but yeah, another two levels it needs to take out to go into price discovery. We'll see if that can happen. All right, guys. So yeah, that's really all I've got for you today. Okay. Um, <laughs> I just want to get home at the moment all right guys so uh, yeah I think I'll end the video there if you're not subscribed to the channel please make sure you subscribe like leave a comment down below also get over onto Twitter and follow me at crypto lightsaber at C R Y P T O L Y T S A B E R. you can also become a patron now for a very small fee there's a link in the description and that gets you access to the telegram channel I know a few of you guys have been asking how to get in all right guys join me over there and you can get access to me and my group. And uh, yeah, that's about it for now. I'll see you guys in the next video.